Hello, I'm Mark Costello. Thank you for having me here today. And I'm pleased to share with this department my findings on how learners in an online learning environment prefer to receive instruction. I believe that online learning will continue to grow in popularity, both due to necessity, as we experienced during the COVID pandemic, as well as due to changing views and expectations of society as younger generations growing up as they use rapidly developing and changing technologies. This survey seeks to identify the preferred method of content delivery from a learner's perspective in an online learning environment. The survey that I put out, I sent the 40 people. Of those 40 people, 10 people responded. All the respondents were anonymous. The survey is comprised of nine questions. Two of those questions are binary uh, in nature, so either yes, no answers or true, false answers. One was a multiple choice question uh, where the respondents selected their favorite choice from a, um, a set of options. And six of those questions were Likert scale questions where they would rank their agreement of a presented statement, either strongly disagree or strongly agree from one through five. The results came back and uh, I, I, I put it into a table for analysis. This is the raw data as it came back in. I, I put it into a bar chart along with the nine questions just to get an idea of how everything was coming in. When I dug deeper into the data that came in and the answers that came in, I felt that this analysis shows the responses in a more usable format. So you'll see that along the X axis that what I've presented here are the, res the percentage of respondents who either agree or strongly agree with the statement presented, as well as question number one and question number nine, which were the two binary questions. And we'll look at those in detail now. So question number one, ask the respondents if they have partaken in an online learning experience within the past three years. 100% of the respondents answered affirmatively that yes, they have. Question number two, 80% of the respondents answered they prefer learning resources which combine two or more types of material delivery. So that would be video clips, gamification, uh, textural material. So the combination of more than one of those modes of delivery. Question number three is 90% of the re respondents report they're more engaged with online learning when they can move through the lessons at their own pace. Question four, 60% agree or strongly agree that they're most comfortable learning new material if they can read text and follow links to make deep dives. Question five, 70% report that they either agree or strongly agree. They enjoy playing online games and they retain information from their gaming experiences better than they do from lectures. Question number six, 50% agree or strongly agree they prefer watching movies rather than reading or playing games, while 40% either disagree or strongly disagree with that statement. Question seven, 70% agree or strongly agree they prefer to have an opportunity to discuss new material with their peers rather than learning on their own. Question eight, 90% say, they feel like they pay attention better when the method of presentation changes, such as video clips and game-like activities combined with textual presentations. And then question number nine was the other binary one. So 100% of the respondents say they pay attention to material better when they know there will be an assessment afterwards. So with that in mind, Here's some actionable takeaways that I, I, I'm gathering from this data. As an OLE creator, I'm gonna to strive to incorporate multiple modes of material delivery in my learning modules. 
I'll include assessments, which are clearly defined at the beginning of the uh, lessons. They'll have clearly defined outcomes and learning objectives. We'll include opportunities for learners to interact and engage with their peers. These are the takeaways that I, I find are presented as important to the online learners when they're in their online learning environments that I can include as an OLE creator. Thank you so much for your time. I am happy to answer any questions.